I started uh, working in NMR spectroscopy in 1993, uh, when I started at uh, the University of California, Berkeley as a first year graduate student. So I've been working in NMR for uh, 28 years now. Uh, and uh, I found NMR rather serendipitously uh, because uh, when I started at Berkeley, I thought I was going to do gas phase laser spectroscopy research because that was my undergraduate research background. Um, and then I went on a sort of a obligatory tour of all the physical chemistry labs uh, at Berkeley, and I visited 12 labs. And my, on my last stop, I visited Alex Pine's group and his research group as a you know, world leader in solid state NMR. Uh, and I was blown away by the fact that in NMR spectroscopy, one can uh, manipulate nuclear spin Hamiltonians uh, at will seems like at will, using radio frequency pulses. And so that was just so impressive. Uh, I, I, even though I knew very little about NMR, it was clear to me that's a very powerful spectroscopy. And then I also knew, well, it's a very practical spectroscopy. It's widely used in the chemical sciences. So, so I, last minute, I decided to switch from laser spectroscopy to, to uh, solid state NMR spectroscopy. And, uh, you know, I really have not regretted my decision. I think it's wonderful. I, I love NMR.